Hello and welcome back to Crazy Hank TV. Today we're going to discuss Batman, the TV series. Yes, the Adam West Batman series. I'm an Adam West fan. That's my favorite Batman. Nothing against Michael Keaton, who I love. Christian Bell was excellent as Batman. But I got to go with the one I grew up with, and that was the Adam West Batman. I love that series. And right now I'm going to give you 10 amazing facts from Batman, the TV series. Batman ran from 1966 to 1968, three seasons, and they filmed 120 episodes. It was on twice a week. So there you go, 120 episodes in only three seasons. Batgirl was supposed to have her own show. Originally, Batgirl was going to be a standalone show. Instead, she became a main character in the third and final season of Batman. Catwoman was played by two different actresses. Uh, it was played by Julie Newmar and Eartha Kitt. The Riddler was nominated for an Emmy. Frank Gorshin was nominated for outstanding performance by an actor in a supporting role in a comedy. Now, hold on a second. Was Batman really a comedy? Okay, I did laugh at it from time to time. For his portrayal as the Riddler. So there you go. Nominated for an Emmy. Not bad. The Joker and the Penguin tied for most appearances. Both villains showed up to make a mess out of everything in 19 episodes each. So there you go. The Joker and the Penguin, 19 episodes. The Batmobile was one of the most iconic elements of the series. The original car from the show was a modified Lincoln Futura. Batmobile was sold at auction in 2013 and fetched a massive $4.2 million. Wow. Historically poor test screenings. In Adam West's 1994 book, Back to the Batcave, the actor revealed that Batman's pilot episode scored in the high 40s, the worst score in the history of pilot testing. The average score is usually in the 60s. Producers made some adjustments by adding things like narration and a laugh track, but the test scores remained unchanged after the show was retested. New special effects were added to production, and ABC decided to stick with it. So it must be pow, bang, boom is what pushed them over the top. I, You know, it's, it's funny how something could test so poorly, yet be so successful. Batman consisted of 34 episodes per season, with two episodes airing each week. That meant a heck of a lot of work for Weston Ward. Even so, Ward was upset to discover he was only being paid $350 a week, which was pretty meager in comparison to his co-star. Cesar Romero played the iconic role of the Joker in the television series. The character's maniacal laugh came from a real laugh that Romero let out when he saw the costume for the first time. Ironically, Frank Sinatra expressed interest in playing the Joker, too. Hmm. Never knew that. I never knew that. Also, side note, uh, he refused, uh, Romero refused to shave off his mustache. Going back to Catwoman, we discussed that Julie Newmar and Eartha Kitt played Catwoman on the TV series for the movie... Spinoff movie in 1966, Lee Merriweather played the part because Julie Newmar was not available to play the part. So there you go. There's some fun facts about the greatest Batman in the history of Batman, the Adam West Batman, the television series. Subscribe, tell a friend, let people know that this channel exists, and we'll be back later on this week. I'm out, people. Bye.